Another steamy summer night in Los Angeles. The kind of night that makes you want to throw your legs up on the desk and give them a break. That's when she walked in. I knew she was trouble from the second the door swung open. Dark hair, brown eyes, and legs. One that went all the way from the floor to her waist. And the other one that went right from her waist to the floor. Excuse me? Are you Clint Dilly, private eye? Unless my eyes deceived me, I counted two. Two perfectly normal legs. One on her left, and one on her right. I may not have known much in this dog-eat-dog -dog world, but I knew what legs looked like. And those were legs. Clint? She asked me my name again. I had to think fast. The name's Clint. And you? You have two legs. Uh, yeah, I do. Listen, my husband's gone missing, and I just can't seem to find him. Each leg seemed to support her body. Either that, or her body was floating like a ghost, and her legs were dangling underneath it. But that seemed unlikely. That seemed crazy. Which is why I need you to track him down. How many legs did he have? Um, two. Anyway, he was last seen. It was a start, but it wasn't enough. And that's when I noticed it. How could I have been so blind? The answer to finding this woman's missing husband had been right under my nose the whole time. Right under my chin. Right under my shoulders. Right under my torso. Right under my waist. Legs. I had a pair also. Was it a coincidence? No. I was convinced my own legs had kidnapped this woman's husband. They must have done it while I was sleeping. My legs told me the whole story. I knew what I had to do. I had to arrest my own legs. Then it occurred to me. Legs. If I had them, criminals probably had them too. And that meant my legs were off the hook. For now. Too bad I lost the key. Did you just arrest your own legs? Huh? Clint, the case has been solved. We found this dame's husband. He was picked up last night by Just one of when I thought the plot was as thick as pea soup. And I mean thick pea soup. Another set of gams enters my little office. Two legs, dressed exactly the same. Why would two legs need to dress exactly the same unless they were in cahoots? Was it a coincidence? Of course it wasn't. Clint, did you arrest your own legs again? They were a suspect before I thought your legs might be in cahoots. What makes you think my legs are in cahoots? Your boots. His boots were in cahoots. I rifled through my drawer for my pistol. I was convinced the officer's legs had murdered this lady's husband. They must have done it while he was sleeping. I was going to shoot them clean off, but just then... He's right here. We found him trying to beat feet to Hawaii and catch a little life insurance policy. This, this freak's legs are entirely naked. naked. Legs. Gams. Walking pegs. Lady stilts. Getaway sticks. Longer arms with feet on them instead of hands. Clint, buddy, you need some serious help. Studio C. If you want more of it, you can find it at byutv.org or you can download the BYUTV app. Either way, you're going to find plenty of other exclusive content there. And be sure to like and share the video and comment telling us what your favorite mystery is. 